Being transferred to the house of a farmer who lives in the Andes, this, with the purpose of getting in touch with a territory where the aroma embraces us when arrival. The bird's son deals us us. We discover colorful bats, adventures, hidden flavors, eyes full of emotion, and smiles guiding us toward the ancestral lives that are part of our roots. Ancestors who reminds us that to preserve is also to use, that paradoxically our breakfast may have more foreign ingredients than local ones, and that in between those large windows we can have a cup of coffee and admire the Andes green that inhabits us. Now take your steps toward the embrace of the one who welcomes us with elegance and open wings to immerse ourselves in the mountains that sing from the sovereignty and the cold of the memories kept by the people of the conservation. Dare to listen to the story that each element narrates from the spectacles of the Colombian Andes. Be aware of what would happen if they did not exist. If the Andes did not exist, the morning coffee would be missing, since the soil that produces the best coffee rises above the clouds of this ending land. If the Andes did not exist, we would be 2,600 meters farther from the stars. Only in such a surreal territory as the Andes can there be a branch of heaven and the city of eternal spring. Time has come for a route to meet the future, for the path of the Andes to lead us to create everything that has not yet been read or written. Do you dare to live in the Andes and tell the stories that have left their mark on you? Keep on track with us and continue one step at a time. But before, I invite you to grab a cup of coffee, take a look around and behold what the Antician hands tell in this wonderful place. As all the roads led to a story, step on the brakes, take a picture, and accelerate. It is time for us to make agreements between us and the nature that inhabits us. Being sensitive to the world around us and assuming ourselves from love, companionship, and care lead us to live in an Andes full of magic, adventure, and human beings with the ability to value the smallest details. A dream that is built by all of us. This exhibit does not stand on one side only. Let's cross the bridge, being aware that we are held by the strength of our people. With our feet to touch the ground, we are guided by the voice of the cougar. Its majesty lead our steps toward its own history, one that represents a new world for everyone. Let us walk to transform, to learn, so that the path of the Andes keeps its colors, its shapes, and the memory of all the ancestors come with us. The fire, the air, the water, and powerful deities carry us deep within the heart of the Andes. The landscape makes its way through the windows that invite us to discover the biodiversity that shelters us. Be it rain, thunder, or a splendorous sun, a green sky covers us with textures and aromas that transport us to that small countryside farmer terrace. The dance of the birds and the steps we walk give us a new welcome to a prom return. Beloved Andes, with me, I will forever carry your story and your sounds. <laughs>